missionary. You're supposed to stay on the trail, pick up your litter, refrain from overnight camping. This is a gated thing, so you know they'd boot your ass out of here. They wouldn't let you even sleep in your vehicle overnight in the parking lot. That's an absolute don't you dare. This is a lot nicer than it's been in past years. Like I'm not driving through really, really super deep potholes here. That cloud. That one. The flat one. Hey, that's the Enterprise. Guys, the Enterprise, they finally read me. They're like, we're here to beam you up. Yay. <laughs> I've been asking for beam up for years now. They maybe finally answered me. Well, it is my birthday and all, so hey, <laughs> happy birthday. We're going to beam you up. Yay. Thank you. Yeah, I'm sorry for the fast turnarounds here. But this is the prairie landscape at its finest, in my opinion. This is why I love the prairie. This is rose hips. I don't see any rose flowers, but I see hips. Whoops, I gotta get a hold of the camera right here. That's one. Okay, I don't know if you guys saw that or not. Oh, look. Is this on? Oh, fuck, is it? Yeah. The sun is on my lens, and sometimes I have moments of, is my camera still on? These are Saskatoon berries. Aren't they nice? That's probably the camera right in there. So then hopefully y'all are getting a really, really good look. And the wind is back. It's just me, me and my shadow. <laughs> Anyways, that was a sudden inspiration. I have definitely been in the sun. It's working. Sand suited vegetation here is what that says. Pause the camera if you'd like to read it in, in, in detail. Yes, detail. That's the word. Don't know if you guys can hear me. Maybe the wind is drowning me out. Directly in front, way in the foreground, background, whatever you want to call it, it's in the distance. It looks like a trail. That is a trail. That's the other trail. You can see it from here. I did not take the fork to the left. Today I'm just going down to the edge to sit on a bench. And you guys will just love the view from there. And there it is. The Saskatchewan River. What a view, hey? I pan a little this way. Let's see here. Over between here and here somewhere. There's an area there for parking. It's like, oh, I can't remember what it's called now. But it's very small, and there's no beach there. There is a beach here. Well, 
Not really. The water's kind of high this year. They had to release Diefenbaker Dam. Alberta was really, really high floodwaters this year, so they had to release it to avoid flooding. The Saskatchewan River starts in Alberta, and I think it empties out into the Hudson Bay. It merges with North Saskatchewan River, and then both of them empty in Hudson Bay. I think way off in the distance, there's a potash mine out there. I know, I'm panning way too quickly. You guys are probably wanting to kick my butt. Meanwhile, I might have to throw music on top of this if my really fancy dancy dead cat, also known as my hand over the speaker, isn't doing the trick. And I don't think my real live cat would agree to sit on my phone. Well, for his own purposes he would. 